Well, so you plateaued. So what? Who cares? What does plateauing mean? We all plateau at one time or another. What does that mean? Let me tell you a story. I had a client, he calls me up, says, Bob, I want to hire you to coach me. We've talked for the last three years. I never hired you because I thought your fees were ridiculous. He goes, I've been stuck around 250 transactions a year for the last three years. Can you help me get to 300? Well, this was on December 16th of that year. And I kind of chuckled to him and I said, well, keep doing what you're doing. He goes, well, obviously you don't listen either. I told you I've been stuck there for three years. I said, I'll tell you what, I'll agree to coach you if you agree to have a goal next year of 350. So he just very cocky said, fine. Okay, I've seen that many times before. Well, on December 7th of the following year, his general manager calls me to thank me they just closed their 350th property and that year he closed 357. The thing is, why do people plateau? Their dreams aren't big enough. How big is big? How big do you want to get? I always say, you know, people say, Bob, when's enough enough? Enough is enough when it starts affecting your personal life. See, in my coaching style, I have no breaks. We only ease our foot off the gas. When we're plateauing, we take our foot off the grass, gas, we find out what's causing the plateau. And if you're selling north of 200 properties, generally it's going to be because you don't have the right people in place, you're not doing the proper tracking. So be, plateauing has many different root causes that you must understand. And when you have plateaued, please speak to somebody about it, but be very open and honest about it. You know, some people are afraid to sell a lot of homes. This is where I go back and say, you know what? If it's not affecting your personal life, why would you care how many homes you sold? You know, I don't think anybody should work more than 50 hours a week. I have clients working 10 hours a week selling 800 homes a year. How do they do it? They became a master of time management and a master of delegation. So plateauing is all about sometimes you being too much of a control freak, wanting to do everything yourself, and you're causing your own stress. Most stress is internal, caused by ourselves, not seeking the proper help. So if you feel you've plateaued, just take a sheet of paper, write down, what is it that you feel you've plateaued? I'm stuck in production. I'm working too many hours. My family says they never see me. Those are all things that can cause you to plateau. Start focusing on the solution. I always say, focus on the positive, focus on the solution, and you will never plateau.